streaming to four platforms at once with Mob Crush. Some people love it and others hate it. Let's talk about it and take a look at the features. What's up everyone, Jelle here with the Video Nerd and welcome to the Streamlabs OBS Master Course. So Lutz was the first free application available in Streamlabs OBS and now there is a second one called Mob Crush Multi-Stream. For those who don't know what it is, it's an application that allows you to stream to Twitch, YouTube, Facebook and Mixer at the same time without requiring more power from your computer. And a complaint that I often heard before was, well, when you use these applications to stream to multiple platforms at once, it's a bad viewing experience for the viewer because you can only pay attention to the chat of one streaming service so the other ones don't get answers to the questions they ask in chat, etc. Well, not anymore because Mob Crush Multi-Stream combines all the chats into one chat window where you can see donations the normal chats, the follows, etc. So you can see everything in one location and this is amazing. So what does this mean? You can stream to four platforms at once while paying attention to only one chat window. Some people say that you should focus on one streaming platform because growing faster on one is better than growing slower on four different ones. And while I agree with that, I don't think that it's always the case and that it comes down to personal preference. Some people will just not feel like going to Twitch or Mixer today, but they might be hanging around on Facebook all day. When you're streaming on Mixer but you're also streaming on Facebook and they follow you, they might get a notification that you are online and they might jump into your stream on Mixer. Something important to keep in mind however is that when you are affiliated or partnered on Twitch, you cannot stream to other streaming platforms within the first 24 hours after the content is streamed to Twitch. Now as far as I know, these other three platforms do not have this policy. So you can use Mob Crush Multi-Stream to stream to Mixer, Facebook and YouTube at the same time. Or if you are not affiliated yet, you can stream to the four platforms at once and maybe use this tool to accelerate your growth till you are affiliated. When your main streaming platform is Twitch and you still would like to distribute the content to other channels, there is however another solution. You can stream to Twitch and then record at the same time or download the full stream when you're done streaming and then you can use Mob Crush Multi-Stream to broadcast your last Twitch stream to the other three channels. So for example on Monday you stream to Twitch alone and then on Wednesday you broadcast that stream to Facebook, YouTube and Mixer. That way you can reuse your content and maybe get some extra followers on Twitch or some likes on Facebook. Now I'm not saying that this is the best thing ever and that you should use it from now till the day you die. Some people love it, other people try to stay as far away of it as possible, but I think that you should just give it a try and see if it works out for you. Let's take a look at the application and set it up right now. So go to Streamlabs OBS and then go to the App Store. There you can go to the free applications and you see Lutz was the first one and the second one is Mob Crush. So you click on it and you can install it right here. I already did so I will open it and then you get this screen. Click on get started and then log in with one of the five available options. I will log in with my Twitch account. So log in and then the application will open. Okay, you can continue right here. So this is the main screen of the application and right here on the left you can connect your four different platforms. Then here on the right you can select the game that you will be streaming, for example Overwatch. You can add your title and you can add your description. But this description will only be for YouTube and Facebook because Mixer and Twitch do not have a description like this. So you type a description and then right here you can see the chat which I talked about. So when you click on it, it will open a new browser window and there all your chats will appear from your Twitch, YouTube, Facebook, whatever you linked. This will include the donations, the follows, normal chats etc so everything in one place let's go back to streamlabs obs and then take a look at the stream stats right here you can see history of all your previous streams and you can also see where it was streamed to and another very handy thing is that you can download your stream immediately right here you just click on download it will open a new window and immediately start downloading the stream which you selected so this is very easy and powerful at the same time. When we go back to the stream settings, 
Right here when you set everything up, you can click on save broadcast info. Let's click save and I will show you what has been changed. When we go to settings and then to stream, right here I had linked my Twitch stream, but right now it's replaced with a custom streaming server, the server of Mob Crush with a stream key. That's why you don't need more PC power. You are just streaming to the Mobcurse server and then they are streaming to the other platforms separately. So are you going to use this application? Let me know down in the comments because I'm really curious about what other people think of this. Remember that this was only one guide in the Streamlabs OBS Master Course playlist. So if you want more guides about Streamlabs OBS, click on the playlist right there. And if you like this video, please like it and share it with someone who can use this content. And if you want more tips and tricks to start streaming and promote yourself on social media, don't forget to subscribe and turn on the notification bell so you don't miss out on future helpful tutorials. I'm Jelle from The Video Nerd and I will see you in my next video. Have a good day.